Hi, Facebook. It's break time. I know I already gave you one video today, but I'm going to give you another one now because I'm on my break. I had some phone calls to make. I made my calls. And I'm bored. I don't have nothing to do right now. Like, I'm texting people. No one's texting me back, so I feel like a fucking loser. So, I decided, hey, I'm going to talk to my friends in Facebook land. So, this is where I am. So, what do you want to talk about, guys and gals? How about, fuck it, let's just do some real talk, tell them why you're mad. Shit that gets on my nerves, and probably gets on your nerves too, Facebook friends. I get so aggravated. This has happened to me a few times. It doesn't happen all the time, but it's happened a few times. Like, if you do a video or you do a status and people automatically assume it's about them. Now, I'll say, I've done that before. Sometimes I've seen people put up a status and I'm like, hmm, is that about me? But the reason that I'm like, is it about me? Is because it's, it's probably something I did. So, obviously, I feel guilty about it. Like, mm, yeah, I fucked up. I did that. It might be about me. But here's the thing, people. If I put up a status or if I put up a video or one of your other friends do or whatever, and you're feeling like that, it doesn't necessarily mean that it's about you. But if the size fits... Feel free to try something on from our Guilty Conscience collection. You might like it. So that's one thing that gets me aggravated. What are some things that piss you guys off Facebook? There's some guys walking down the street over here. They're going to think I'm a nut because I'm on my phone. Some people should not wear fucking tank tops. Watch, wait, I'm going to wait till this guy goes by a little bit. And then I'm going to turn the camera so that you can see him. And you vote, should he be wearing a tank top? Do, do you see him? Did you see him? I don't think he should be wearing a tank top. So, like I said earlier in my other video, it's Friday night. So, I'm sure some people got plans. I don't really have plans tonight. Sometimes it's good not to play, make plans and just, like, let things happen. Because sometimes you end up with a better night that way. You never know. But, I don't know. I don't really have plans for tonight. I want to have some fun. But I'm thinking that if nothing else works out... I'm probably going to just drink me a bottle of some nice Arbor Mist wine because I'm a total cheap date and I can't hold my fucking liquor when I drink because I'm not that much of a drinker. So if worse comes to worse, I'm going to just play fucking pretend that my boat is like a bed and play Life of Pi with my cat or my dog. What are you guys doing tonight, Facebook? Let me know what your plans are. I want to know what everybody's up to. Maybe I'll come join you. You never know. I might just pop up and maybe we can do a video together. All right, guys. That's like three minutes of my life. I rambled. I'm bored. Got a few more hours of work. Then I'm blowing this popcorn stand for the weekend. I'll talk to you later, Facebook. Goodbye.